Hi everybody, here's a video to give you a quick overview of Trello's latest release for business class and Trello Enterprise customers. The feature is called Advanced Checklists and in this demo I can quickly show you how it works. So this is a board I have set up for an upcoming feature release and as part of that we're going to do a launch blog. So here we have several items that need to be done for this blog and previously in checklists you would have just had a simple list like this but now you can add members and due dates to the items. You can do this using the two buttons here or using the usual keyboard shortcuts such as space for adding yourself or D for adding a due date. Once you've done that you can view these items in two new ways. One is in the calendar so this is a power up from Trello here we can see the checklist items have been added to the calendar view and this is a regular card view just so you can tell the difference. The other good place to view these is on your home screen. So if we open this up, we can now see the items listed at the top of your home screen homepage feed and you can interact with them from this view as well if you need to check some things off quickly. And the final thing to mention is that this is also compatible with Butler, Trello's automation tool. So you can run certain automations that will interact with the checklists. For example, if I had completed all of these tasks and we got to the point where we needed to publish the blog, I can hit publish. And in the background, Butler will run an automation. And here we can see Butler has finished running and it has added an additional item to the checklist, which is to share this blog on social media. It has assigned it to me and it has set the due date for two days after the dates that I hit publish, which is today. So there you have it. That's a quick overview of Trello's latest release, Advanced Checklists.